Chris, welcome back. And in this video, I'll show you my brand new trading setup. So one thing to know is that from March, I've literally been moving cities a lot and just buying new screens every time uh, I went somewhere, okay? So I'm very happy to be now here in Panama City for a little bit longer so I can actually invest a little bit more in my trading setup. So the main detail about this setup for me is first of all this view, okay? I mean the actual location of the setup with this great big wall and the view I can go out is just so good to work and yeah just to be here every day so looking at the actual setup this is a custom made standing desk so the desk goes up and the desk goes down so the desk was custom made by a craftsman here in panama i'll leave his details below if you live in panama i really recommend him as you may know um Panama is a lot of imports, so you don't have shops as IKEA and very simple furniture shops. So yes, this has been uh, custom made. It has a beautiful piece of one, uh, beautiful wood, and the stands are white, uh, just to bring a bit of light. Um, the, the, the whole room is very light. So yeah, just wanted to keep that. Now, if we look below the desk, that's where we have all the cable management. So everything has been attached to the desk so it goes up and down with everything and we just have this white snake coming down so it's very discreet on the wall and we have some also some plugs right here at the back that were installed on the left side of the desk so I can charge my phone and do if I need to plug something. Now if we look at what powers the whole trading setup it's this uh, MacBook Pro 16 inch from 2020. It's the high spec in order to uh, run everything smoothly. Now the MacBook Pro is connected to the monitors by USB-C cables and I also have this dock that allows me to have more USB inputs, SD cards, HDMI etc. Now looking at the actual monitors I have two LG ultra wide and one AOC 24 inch. Now the actual layout of the setup I really like simply because the uh, length of that AOC 24 inch is the width of these two LG Ultra Wide. So when you're actually working and moving screens around, it's very efficient, okay? It just looks like one big massive screen. So it's very efficient for my work. I generally have my main trading screen here, some stuff here. I usually have things turning around there, so probably Bloomberg or something news. And right here I have the chat where I'm, uh, I have basically a virtual trading floor where I can see what everyone's posting, ideas, etc. So these monitors are held by this monitor stand from Vivo. So as I said in Panama, most of things are imported. So yeah, you can probably find it uh, cheaper in Europe or in the US or something. But yeah, they're very straightforward. Now on the actual desk, I have this magic keyboard from Apple. Uh, it's the 2020 Space Gray. Uh, it's very light. It's very pretty amazing however it's not backlit and you don't have the option to pay more to have it backlit i mean come on apple for the price of this uh, if you're on a budget i would definitely not recommend it i'm sure you have better for cheaper now on the right of it i have the logitech mx master 3 as a mouse and it's probably the best mouse on the market okay um the the actual made of this the build, build quality is amazing um you have so many buttons you have this on the side uh, in order to, to move your trading screens uh, and you also have these three buttons now these three buttons allow me to connect to different devices so at the moment it's connected to my whole trading setup through this mac but with one click i can connect it to that hp nvi i7 uh, computer that i use for everything that i can't run on a iOS device, okay? So Windows is very versatile, as you know. So yes, I always have this one and that I can use with the keyboard, with the mouse, very easily without having to unplug anything or make it complicated. Now at the center of the setup, I have this black leather mat, uh, which just, uh, yeah, protects the desk and it's just uh, much better to work on. Uh, also, I take a lot of notes on paper. Um, I really like writing, uh, I'm much more creative when I write down things and I just apply my work on the screens. So yeah, that just makes it much more um, enjoyable. And I have this uh, Mont Blanc fountain pen. So one thing to know about me is I am a fan of calligraphy since I'm at school. So yes, uh, with a gold nib, it's, uh, yeah, I mean, it's, it's just a pen to be fair, but I really like it. So behind the monitors, I have two Logitech speakers for a stereo sound. Um, I have a sound system in my home, 
So yes, I didn't need anything fancy or super loud. I just use it to watch YouTube videos or if I'm watching the news or something. So yeah, just uh, some handy little speakers with all the cables hidden, of course. Now, right here, I have the Blue Yeti microphone, which is, uh, yeah, very straightforward, a good microphone. And it's on this um, movable stand, which is very handy just to move it around when you don't use it, when you use it, etc. And we have these LED strips at the back of the desk. So during the day, you can probably not see them a lot, but at night, it's very enjoyable. I have a remote control to change the lighting, etc., and just make it overall ambiance, which is very fine. Now, just above, I have three clocks with the New York, London, and Tokyo uh, time. So that just helps me with the overall trading session. And I have, of course, many friends in London, so it's always good to know uh, what time is it, what time I can call, etc. So yes, this is very handy when you are trading and it's very cost efficient, doesn't cost a lot. Now looking at the decorations of the setup, I have just one plant here. I have a canvas, which I think is super cool, very ironic, um, and yeah, very unique with what I do, the US dollar. Um, and right here, I also have a um, vegetation wall, however you want to call it which is just super cool with the view behind and yeah, just makes it a bit more friendly and easy to be in. So I hope you enjoyed this video that was highly requested and let me know down in the comments if there's anything I could add, like some accessories or so. I know there's so many like under $100 tech on Amazon or so. So if you have any ideas of some things I could add, definitely leave them down in the comments. I'll read everything. And uh, yeah, if you like the video, definitely go subscribe, go like, activate the notification bell and yeah, do the whole thing. See ya.